hello guys if this is your first time of watching my youtube video please do well to subscribe and click on the red button so that whenever i publish a new video you will be the first person to get notification in this tutorial i'm going to teach you how to install open cv library we have two methods of installing open cv or we have two methods of installing any library you can install in you can install library from a, your command line or you can install it from anaconda navigator so in today's tutorial we're going to install open cv in our anaconda navigator so this is our anaconda navigator then go to click on the environment remember in our last tutorial we created an environment called hello world if you navigate to your spider and type a code import cv2 that is open cv and run the code you can see from the output that the code is giving an error import error that to say that we haven't installed open cv so the only way you can install this library open cv or any other library is to install it from your command line or you can install it from your anaconda navigator so the next step here is to click on the hello world to activate it then the next step is to go to the installed application you find out that here we don't have anything like open cv so what you are going to do is to search here and click on the not installed so on the right type open cv from here you can find it you can find open cv that is computer vision and machine learning software library so you can choose to install the tray so the first one here is the computer vision and machine learning software library second one is almost the same thing so you can choose to install three of them so the next step here is to click on the apply below you can see it here apply it's going to take a small time to install so we're going to have patience for the installation to take place okay the next thing that you're going to do is to install the packages here we have up to system packages to be installed so click on apply The process of installation has begun so it's going to take a while to complete the installation
okay there is a question here it says update application there is new version of anaconda navigator available we strongly rec recommend you to update no remind me later so there is an important thing that i want to point out here before installing any library make sure that your internet is on make sure that your wi-fi or your internet browser is on because anything that you want to install is going to use internet it's going to use your wi-fi or any source of your browser to install any library so make sure that your internet is on so you can see that from here we were able to install open cv so for you to confirm if the installation has taken place or not go back to here and check installed then you can find out that then you will find out that those three uh those from here you can find out that they have been installed then what you are going to do next is to navigate to your spider ide so on your spider ide then type import cv2 then run it again you can see that the, the, the output is okay so for you to check if it's running for example I can say that my image I can type something like part image part is equals to let me choose a part of my image let me choose the part of my image then let me copy the part then here I'm going to paste it here then I'm going to change this to slash I'm going to change this to slash then I'm going to write runner that is the name of my image and the format as JPG then again I'm going to write IMG will be equal to CV2 CV2 that is open CV dot I am rich I am rich of my part of my image part then the next thing I'm going to do is to write CV2 dot wait key so I'm going to insert zero there, CV2 of weight key, then CV2 dot destroy all windows. Then here I'm going to write CV2 dot I am sure. I am sure of what? The first input here I'm going to define. The name of my email I'm going to say original image original image then it's going to display my IMG so you can see the program so let us run it to make sure that our CV2 is working properly so run okay so you can see it now that our cv2 is working 
properly so this is where i'm going to end today's tutorial in our next tutorial we are going to install other libraries like matplot library and uh, numpy thank you very much for your time see you in our next video thank you